Hey guys, welcome back to another video from Matt Gourmet Kitchen. Today I'll be showing you guys how to prepare some delicious curry mints. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe and also click that notification bell to get notified when I upload all my contents. All that I'll be using to prepare my curry mints will be listed down in the description box so you guys can just go there and get the full ingredients. Javi Beats exclusive. Here is all my ingredients that I'll be using to prepare my delicious curry mince. I'll be using some curry powder. Here I got some onion powder. I got some garlic powder. Some all-purpose seasoning. Some fresh thyme. Some paprika. You're gonna need some turmeric. You're gonna need some white drawn pepper. I got some chopped garlic. And here I got some diced Irish potato. I got one scotch bonnet pepper that I'll be using. And here I got some chopped onion. I got some fresh chopped bell pepper and here I got my beef mince that I'll be using. All the measurements for my ingredients will be listed down in the description box. Now you want to go ahead and get yourself a basin, a shine basin like this where I'll be adding my mincing. I was removing it from my package now. curry powder onto that now also my garlic powder my onion powder now I'm going with my all-purpose seasoning just a teaspoon half teaspoon of my dry thyme I'm going my paprika, just a teaspoon. A teaspoon of my turmeric powder. And a half teaspoon of my ground white pepper. Is that not nice? Now I'm just gonna go in and rub in all my seasoning onto my mince. So I'm gonna go ahead and massage it in. Rubbing those seasoning properly onto your mints, so guys. There you have it, guys. Now I'm just gonna leave this to marinate for about half an hour. I will be right back with you guys when this is finished marinating. Now, here you have it. After that 30 minutes, my beef is fully marinated now. now just now you want to go ahead and get your pot where you'll be cooking up your mincing. You just want to preheat that pot with about 2 tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. Guys, if you don't have extra virgin olive oil, you can use your oil of your choice. It's up to you. Now I'm just going to preheat this for about 2-3 to three minutes. And then get right back with you. Now my oil on my pot is preheated. Yes guys, you want to make sure your fire is on a medium low heat. Up now, I'm adding just a teaspoon of my curry. I'm gonna burn that curry in your into your oil, guys. So I'll spread that around. To that now, I'm adding my chopped garlic. So guys, and make sure you have that garlic in here. Make sure you burn your curry into your oil. How you do not hurt your belly. The garlic will prevent that, guys. So you don't get that. So your belly will not hurt you. So that, guys. Now I'm going with my chopped onion. I just want to saute these guys for about a minute. One or two. Going with my sweet peppers, and here I've already cut up my scotch bonnet pepper. This guy is not adding nothing to. I'm going to 
I'm stirring in my room. What I do when I'm stirring. Season is smelling so nice, guys. I like this one. Season when they are frying up, it smells so nice, especially that garlic and the curry. Wow, it's smelling so nice, guys. To that now, I just want to go ahead and break it up. I just want to cook up this mince for about 7 to 8 minutes guys. So I want to make sure your, beans, your mince is properly cooked. In the meanwhile between that 7 to 8 minutes guys, I just want to keep stirring it around. I'm just going to cover this up now and leave it to cook and I'll get right back to you guys. Now here you have it guys, after that 7 to 8 minutes. Guys, I remember between that 7 to 8 minutes I was stirring it. This guys, if you don't want your mints to burn and stick to the bottom of the pot, so you have to keep stirring it around. This guys, so you can see. Our curry mints. Smells so nice, guys. I wish you wasn't able to smell this aroma that's coming from the pot, guys. You can see the mints is in here. Going in with a cup of water to that now. Also, I'm going in with my chopped, my chopped Irish potato to that now. Just gonna mix up that now. Where I'm gonna cover this up now again and leave this for about our next 10 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes to cook. This guys, so those Irish can get all soft. So we mix it around. Just like that now. Just gonna cover that up now guys and leave that for about 10 to 15 minutes and I get right back to you. Now checking back on my curry mints after that 10 minutes. Let's see, see if my Irish are all soft. Yes guys. My fork is just going right through it. This guys. This is so ready to turn off, but I give it a taste. So it's tasting like. Maybe any salt or any more seasoning to it. This guys. I'm just going in with some more all more of my all, all purpose. I'm adding like a teaspoon. You know you're not subscribed to my channel as yet go ahead and click that subscribe button and put it on all to be notified and upload my videos this guys wow. i'm just going to give this about five more minutes before i turn it off and i get back to you guys now here you have it guys wow smelling so nice this is how you want to prepare that curry mince at home this guys all those lovely ingredients that I show you. Look at that, guys. Beautiful. Look at that. Tell you. Let me just give it a taste now. Except all is well. Irish potatoes are all soft now. Perfect, guys. This is all you want to prepare that curry mince at home. Just like this. I can turn this off. I'm just gonna share this out now and let you guys see with my 
my coconut rice. Now here you have it guys, I've served up my curry mints with my coconut rice and to go along with it did some mixed vegetables, some fried plantain and some avocado. Yes guys, this is how you want to prepare that delicious curry mints at home for you and the family. It's so simple and easy to make guys with those ingredients that I show you. Take less than 45 minutes. Yes guys. Guys, you can also look out for my coconut rice video coming out soon teaching you how to make this lovely coconut rice at home thanks for watching Matt Gourmet Kitchen don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe and also hit me up in the comment section guys and tell me what you think about this curry mints until next time thanks for watching